Are you ready to uncover the hidden Tesla secret that could potentially make you a fortune? Imagine being among the select few who learn about the eagerly awaited latest updates on Tesla's groundbreaking secret vehicle. Brace yourself because this is not just any ordinary vehicle. It has the potential to skyrocket your wealth. Tesla's future vehicle lineup is a topic of great interest and speculation. While we know the much anticipated Cybertruck is set to be built this year, there are still many unknowns about the upcoming models. For instance, we know that a smaller and more affordable Tesla vehicle is in development, but we don't have any concrete information about its design, capabilities, or release date. Another mystery project is a van that Elon Musk has been hinting at for years, but until recently, we didn't have much evidence to go on. In this video, you'll learn everything there is to know about the van, Tesla's most ambitious project to date, and the impact that this will have on your pocket as a Tesla investor. But before we get going, be sure to like and subscribe for more earth-shattering Tesla stock news. However, things have started to become clearer thanks to a series of breadcrumbs that Tesla has been dropping. One important clue comes from a slide in Tesla's Investor Day presentation, which shows the projection of the company's fully electric global vehicle fleet. The Cybertruck is grouped with a mysterious vehicle hidden behind a digital sheet that's shaped like a van. This is the strongest indication yet that a Tesla van is indeed in the works. Elon Musk has also been more explicit about his plans for a van in the recent years. In 2016, he referred to it as a high passenger density urban transport in his master plan part two. And in July 2022, he tweeted about the idea of a highly configurable Donovan for people and cargo, which was met with overwhelming approval from his followers. A rendering of a potential Tesla van created by a fan and shared by Musk showed a futuristic design that was consistent with the Cybertruck's aesthetic. Speaking of the Cybertruck, it turns out that this model may hold the key to the Tesla van's design. When Musk announced at the opening party for Giga Texas that Tesla was developing a new electric vehicle, he described it as a dedicated robo-taxi that's going to look quite futuristic. If we assume that the robo-taxi is the same thing as the van, then it's reasonable to expect that the two vehicles will share many features and design elements. So what can we expect from the Tesla van, aka the Cybervan? Based on the evidence we have so far, we can make some educated guesses. It'll likely have a high passenger capacity, be highly configurable for different types of cargo, and have a futuristic design that's consistent with the Cybertruck's angular industrial look. It may also be equipped with autonomous driving capabilities, given Musk's focus on developing robo-taxis. Imagine this. Could a Cybertruck-inspired van keep the stainless steel exoskeleton that has captivated so many fans? I'd say yes, it's possible. For a transport van to be truly effective, efficient, and comfortable, it needs to have a high passenger density. This means it should be tall enough for the average person to stand up right inside. At the same time, it also needs to be incredibly safe, upholding Tesla's standards as the safest vehicle on the road. Safety is at the core of Elon Musk's design philosophy, and when you're cramming more people into one vehicle, it becomes even more important to keep them all safe if something goes wrong. As much as I love the idea of the glass bubble concept design, I'd never want to be inside one of those on the road. There are too many drivers playing with their phones behind the wheel, not to mention drunk lunatics cruising around in their F-150s. I want something solid between me and the outside world, so what better than an ultra-hard sheet of solid steel? It allows for a tall-sided vehicle that has strength and rigidity, which is not the case with a large van or a bus. Another advantage of using steel is the ability to remove paint from the equation, removing any concern over scratches, dents, or corrosion. If we're thinking about a commercial fleet of robo-taxi vehicles, we want the lowest overhead cost possible. That's why there's a strong case to be made that a Cybervan should share most of the same power electronics as a Cybertruck. You wouldn't need the power of three or four motors for a van, but a dual motor setup is typically the best for maximum range. This means a high torque motor in the rear to get the vehicle in motion and a high efficiency motor in the front for cruising. If there's a dual motor Cybertruck in the future, it'll likely be the same platform as the Cybervan. This includes the fully adjustable air suspension system, which drops down to the ground to allow people to easily step inside, even if they're elderly or disabled. You can easily roll in a wheelchair or a baby stroller, it just makes sense. The biggest advantage that this vehicle is going to take from the Cybertruck is the 1000 volt electric architecture. The Tesla Semi is the first high voltage vehicle that the company has produced. 
Your average Tesla runs at 400 volts for power electronics, but the Semi runs at 1000 volts. When the Semi was fully unveiled at the delivery event, Tesla engineers promised that the Cybertruck would share the same 1000 volt architecture. The biggest practical advantage of high voltage is high charging speed. With its humongous battery pack, the Semi can charge at 1 megawatt of power. The Cybertruck platform is going to have a very large battery pack, but not as big as the Semi, but the largest of any consumer grade Tesla. With the added capabilities of the V4 supercharger, we're expecting to see this platform charge at around 500 kilowatts to as high as maybe 750. Even with the large battery, these vehicles will still charge very fast, which is also the key for a robo taxi. You want as little downtime as possible. On the subject of charging and power management, we can bring solar panels into discussion. Elon has always shrugged off the idea of putting a solar roof on any Tesla vehicle, but it's possible that we could see a solar powered cyber van in the future. Imagine a vehicle that not only has a massive battery pack, but also gets some of its energy from the sun. It's an exciting idea. The potential of solar energy in the Cybertruck has been a topic of discussion. While some doubt its practicality, envisioning the additional complications and expenses, there is speculation that the truck's bed cover might incorporate solar panels. However, when it comes to a van, Elon Musk has previously mentioned that its larger surface area could make solar power more feasible, especially if there are design features that allow for additional solar panels to extend from the sides. This makes the van a strong contender to become Tesla's first vehicle with factory installed solar power. Even if the solar array doesn't directly charge the main battery pack, it could still be utilized to power the cabin electronics such as screens, electric seat adjustments, and power doors. Similar to the Cybertruck, all of these systems would run on 48 volt power, making a departure from the automotive industry's traditional reliance on 12 volt lead acid batteries. Tesla's adoption of lithium ion technology takes things to the next level. Now, imagine your robotaxi offering exceptional free Wi-Fi everywhere. It's no coincidence that SpaceX has developed Starlink Roam, a high-speed satellite internet system designed for use while in motion, such as in an RV or van. The availability of autonomous driving or full self-driving capabilities becomes crucial for the success of the envisioned cybervan. Tesla would likely position it as something other than a traditional minivan, as the market for such vehicles has been mostly overshadowed by large SUVs. Moreover, people are having fewer kids on average, making a vehicle capable of carrying 12 passengers less relevant to the current generation. Elon Musk has been eager to create a vehicle without a steering wheel or pedals, eliminating those components. The Cybervan could be the first Tesla vehicle to realize this vision. These vans are imagined as fully autonomous people movers and delivery vehicles for the robo-taxi service. Summoning a van with an app, stepping in and enjoying a comfortable ride before reaching the destination could be the new norm, convenient and hassle-free. While the van can navigate itself to the drop-off location, the last 20 feet to the door may still require human assistance in the short term. Until highly reliable all-terrain robots become commonplace, the use of a Tesla bot seems fitting. Despite the hype around the drone delivery, it may not be practical for large items or numerous packages. The skies would be congested with drones buzzing around incessantly. Delivery vans, on the other hand, offer a reliable solution with the need for automation in the process. Of course, before exploring the Cybervan concept, Tesla must first realize the production and delivery of the Cybertruck to the eager customers who have been waiting for years. This will take time but it's the next logical step to extract maximum utility from the new platform, just as the Model S led to the Model X and the Model 3 paved the way for the Model Y. If you enjoyed this engaging content, remember to give the video a big thumbs up to support its reach to more people. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.